What's up everybody? <laughs> we are back with another video heading out again. Today we are targeting lake trout and salmon. Hopefully we can get into a big one. That's the goal, but we're just looking to get into some fish. I'm just excited to get out again and, and uh, have some fun. So don't go anywhere. Let's catch some fish this morning. Just got started here and I already have a fly. I don't even have all my traps set. Oh, I think I just lost him. Nope. Wait a minute. Oh, he's still there. I think he's still there. I think he's just swimming with me. Well, I don't know why my GoPro cut out just as I was pulling them up through the hole, but hey, we got a good start with the salmon, just a little guy. We're going to unhook him and get him back in the water, but oh, these fish are so beautiful, just so beautiful. Well, let's get him back in the water. All right. We're on the board. Now I gotta figure out what's going on with my GoPro. But, uh, nice, 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 nice. All right, second flag of the day, same trap. Um, that's weird. Did you take my bait? Did he hit? Interesting. I think he may have been hit. So this is my second time fishing this lake. We're on the board. We've got one salmon. I would like to try to catch a laker or a salmon that's a little bigger. But that might be the only two flags we got. The first one was a salmon, just a small one. Second one was, uh, it was hit, but they didn't take the bait. You killed my bait. Oh, they didn't take it. Probably another salmon. Sometimes salmon will do that. Uh, I mean, I'm trying everything right now. I've got two traps in closer to shore. I say closer to shore. Yeah, I guess so. Um, right underneath the ice. I've got about six feet to eight feet of leader out. And then I've got three out deep. So... It's about 30 to 40 feet of water right here. And I'm going after lake trout. So what I did is I put my bait about 10 to 15 feet down. Um, I didn't want to put them right on bottom. I wanted them to be up a little bit. And then this one over here, where is it? Right there. I actually didn't have a sinker for that one. So what I did was, because it's about 40 feet right there from... I didn't sound it out, but I mean, there's a ledge right here, so I got to guess it's probably right around there. But what I've done is that I put out about 15 feet of leader and line out to just let him free swim. See if we can hook into a salmon or maybe a toad coming up off bottom to hit it. That's hope anyways. Within another hour and a half or so, if we don't catch any fish, I'll check the bait again. I might check it right now just to see how it looks um and if things don't change if i'm not catching any toga or anything on shiners i might throw a dead sucker on bottom but we'll see yeah we'll see i'm just having fun either way i've moved a few traps here and there you never know you just gotta vary it especially if you don't know a lake that well if you haven't fished it that much you just gotta try different things and eventually if you fish it enough you figure it out there's only one way you can figure it out and that's just getting out there and doing it and that's what we're doing so stay tuned hopefully we can get another flag if not then it is what it is so it's been a few hours now it's right around 11 o'clock give or take and we haven't had another flag we had two right off the bat on the same trap so that was that had me in pretty high hopes but now it's shut right off, but hey, 
This is fishing. This is ice fishing. This is what happens. And I'll be honest, it'd be nice to get a lot of flags on camera, but I, I want to catch a big fish. That's my goal today, and that's going to be my goal for the rest of the year, hopefully, is getting out and just catching some big ones. And this is what happens when you fish for the big ones. Sometimes it's just, it's very slow, and it can be very slow. But you just got to have patience, and you got to wait them out. And if you catch one, it's freaking awesome, but if you don't, at least you're out here trying. That's all you can ask for. But you can't just try once or twice and hope that you're going to catch a big one. you got to put in the time. And if you don't, then you won't catch a big fish. All right. Flag number three. Let's see if it's moving. Oh, yeah. It's running good. Oh, that's running real good. Oh, whatever that is, it's fighting good. He's swimming at me now. He's swimming at me now. Oh, salmon. Nice. There we go. Nice little salmon. Whew. Nice. I want to say he's about... 14 or 15. Let's measure them here. Just barely 14. But you know what? We're gonna let him go. Sweet! Salmon number two. Awesome, I got that one hopefully all on camera. I need to go get a new bait. And we got another one. Same trap. All right, let's see if it's moving. Let me get my GoPro ready first. Oh, that is moving. Moving fast, actually. Holy oh, cow. Was moving fast. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Man, he's shaking his head an awful lot. Another salmon. Just a little guy. Um, there we go. About 12 inches. Maybe. One more look at him before I put him in the water. But look how beautiful these fish are. Just stunning. All right, bud. Oop. Back in the water you go. Just like that, another salmon. Just a small guy. 12 or so seems to be we've caught three salmon on the same trap that seems to be the going thing right now between 12 to 14 i'd like to try to catch a bigger one but hey at least we're catching fish so i'm going to put a new hook on this and uh put a new bait on the line and send it down those of you who saw me cut the line just to let you know that that hook will dissolve in about two weeks um it's actually safer to just cut the line like that and let the hook dissolve and then try to rip it out of their guts if you ever see a fish swallow a hook like that, you don't have to kill it. Just cut the line um, if you don't want to keep it. So enough of that. Let me put a new hook on this and let's get a new bait in the water. All right, it's 2.30. We were going to give it till 3, but we're going to call it a day. Uh, it's starting to cool off a lot and I got to get back to the town. So we're going to pick up and hopefully while we're picking up, one of these flags will go off so we can get one more. But uh, yeah, I'll meet you all back in the truck. Just like that, we are all done. Good day today, we caught three salmon. We didn't get any Lakers like we wanted to, but these things happen. We'll uh, try to get back out here and give it another go, but at least we can say we put in an honest effort. But three salmon, I think that's a successful day. Anytime we catch fish, that's success. Thank you all for joining me on this trip. This was a lot of fun, like always. And also, as always, I'll see you guys next time.